Well, hello. Ian in London here with a little present. Always love getting these through the post. Today, just having a bit of a laugh with uh, landing the Mavic. Um, I think uh, somebody felt sorry for me in my last video when I was trying to land on a doormat, and so they've actually kindly sent me a little landing pad to uh, try out. So this is the uh, little landing pad from RC Geek, which sounds fantastic. But I thought I'd actually have a little look today at uh, some of the landing systems that the Mavic employs when it comes down, it comes into land uh, to try and protect it and you from going wrong. Right. All wrapped up. There it goes, it comes in a nice little uh, carry bag. Wow. Spirit levels technical stuff. More spirit levels. Mega stickers. Landing pad itself. Happy little lights, changing colours no less. Excellent. So before we actually uh, play around with the landing pad, um, I thought it'd be a good idea just to outline exactly what's going on with the Mavic when it tries to land. Um, you've actually got three different systems that are kicking in. You've got the uh, GPS that's obviously recording the home point coordinates. Um, on the bottom you've actually got a number of sensors as well. You've got two ultrasonic sensors that are uh, looking out for obstacles when you come into land. You've also got two small cameras that visually take a, a, a photo of uh, where you're taking off from. So again, when it's coming back to land, it can reorientate itself and uh, try and land in exactly the same position in the same direction as when you took off from. So you can't always take off on grass and uh, sometimes you don't want to take off from the ground either because you might have some uh, distractions around you. If I start this up now, Ted will go bananas. So I need to move it onto the table. Right, we'll see how we... Um... We'll see how we take off with that. All right, Ted. I think I'm going to have to take Ted inside. He's getting a little bit too worked up. So, right, just two seconds. Okay, so with Ted safely back inside, I thought first of all we'll take off on the grass and uh, see how it copes and then try the uh, happy little landing pad and see if that makes any difference. Okay, looks like it's coming down at pretty much the same spot. And there we go. Um, I'd have to say that's uh, probably less than six inches away from where it took off from. So um, pretty good in my books. Now we have our subtle little landing pad. It's level. Do I turn on the LED lights or will that confuse it? I have to turn the lights on. Okay, more than 20 meters away, let's do return to home. Okay, he's not going to... Not great. So there we go. Uh, to me, the landing pad is more of a takeoff pad. Uh, useful if you're in long grass or you've got some rough ground. 
but um, it's actually going to complicate things if you try and use it for landing. Personally, myself, I prefer to hand catch when I land. Uh, some people don't like doing that. Some people are scared of the propellers. But for me, um, it's very controlled and uh, very precise each time. So the idea is, as it comes down um, from the camera side, uh, to avoid the downward sensors, you just reach up and hold it firmly. It may try and rev up, uh, you just hold it firmly and after three seconds, as long as you're holding the uh, left thumb down, it, the motors will shut down. Simple as that. For me, hand catching works every time. Uh, it's the uh, usual way that I land my Mavic, um, unless I'm on concrete or something like that. Uh, grass is generally okay. Anything longer than a couple of inches can snag the propellers though. So there you go guys, bit of fun. Um, have to say, maybe useful as a takeoff pad, no use as a landing pad. And I'd actually say that in, Truth for most uh, landing pads, to be honest. The Mavic has got some good sensors. It's always going to land roughly where it took off. Uh, if you have got rough terrain, then I would suggest you get used to hand catching. It's not that hard and um, it's, it's going to be a lot safer for your Mavic than trying to land on rough ground or trying to land on a very narrow, small little landing pad. Anyway, as ever, have fun. Happy flying. <laughs> Okay, in you go. Take cover. Take cover.